The cadence, the precision, the ceremony, all part of the life celebration honoring a dedicated Baltimore City police officer. Kiana Holly, affectionately known by her family and friends as Kiki, was remembered as an officer who loved her job and cared about her community. During her funeral, Governor Larry Hogan told her family, friends, Baltimore police, and officers from neighboring communities, the state grieves today such a senseless and tragic loss, but can't help but being inspired by her incredible life. Mayor Brandon Scott said she was a great and phenomenal woman. She was a hero. She was a superwoman. She balanced her job of being a mother, police officer, and change maker. Police Commissioner Michael Harrison said, thank you for being a servant of Baltimore and thank you for doing it well. And Lieutenant Curtis Worthy, her shift commander in Southern District said, she was the spiritual embodiment of the police department. She gave everything she had every day. She brought healing to a community ravaged by gunfire, drugs, and violence, and the community loved her. She was just, you know what, she was just awesome. She was awesome. If you got to know her, you got to know a good person. Holly was shot while on duty in Curtis Bay. She had volunteered to work overtime. Police said she was in her patrol car when two men ambushed her. Both were arrested. She died December 23rd. She was part of changing the city right here. And she was taken out like that. So sad, so sad. From the convention center, her funeral procession traveled through downtown Baltimore and headed to King Memorial Park in Windsor Mill for burial. Others reflecting on her life say she was sincere, genuine, and passionate, and she wanted us all to walk in unity. Reporting from downtown Baltimore, Barry Sims, WBAL-TV, 11 News.